Remember the digits, 988. You have reached the National Suicide Prevention Lifeline. Mental health advocates and lawmakers hope those three numbers will someday become as memorable and effective as 911. If you are in emotional distress or suicidal crisis or concerned about someone who might be, we're here to help. Governor Jay Inslee recently signed into law a bill designating 988 as the state's suicide prevention hotline, part of a nationwide system. It launches next July and will tie together in-state call centers with 911 operators, police, and behavioral health providers to connect people in distress with immediate help. For most people, the only number they know to call is 911. This may end up having an officer come to their house Officers are not social workers, nor do they want to be. A small tax on phone lines will pay for an expansion of mental health response services and better training for people answering crisis calls. You know, you can't make it hard for people. You have to make it easy and you have to make them trust the response that's behind calling that number. Jen right Stuber now, is a UW well, professor who studies suicide prevention efforts and says Washington's 988 system will be much more robust than the current hotlines. It would be a bad outcome to just have people bounce to a national call center to be assessed and be told they need help. That's not what we're looking for. We're really looking to connect people to services they need when they're in crisis and then longer term. The state is spending about $95 million to build up the 988 system over the next several years. And again, it does not launch until July of next year. Ted Land, King 5 News.